Hey everybody, Isaac here. We are taking a look at a couple of knives here. One I showed you the other day. It is this, the SOG Northwest Ranger. And with this, we are going to take a look at the Cold Steel SRK. And a couple of people uh, commented on my video on this that it kind of reminds them of a Cold Steel. Well, let's look at the handles here. And that is why. We got these rubberized grips, uh, Craton, if you will. I'm not sure if uh, that is specifically Craton on the SOG. I believe it is on the Cold Steel SRK, but Craton, you know, whatever. Uh, it's it's rubber. <laughs> uh, rubberized. It's it's rubber over molded over molded over the tang. So they these both would technically be considered stick tang knives um but you know some call them full tang because they're still really one solid piece of steel but they both have a, a really nice rubber texturing here um sog has got their logo on there uh so they used to put their logo just everywhere um cold steel does not uh very very nice grip on both i like the rubberized grip on these blades um another thing to point out is they both have that single lanyard tube at the bottom which you know it's calls for the the cry of the similarities now the up and up of the sog is that it has a steel guard and you got that nice uh those nice grooves there you can see like the grooved in there on that seal guard while cold steel guard is just rubber and you know it flexes I think this knife they, they need to do like a a pro or yeah I guess people will call them pro models of the SRK and make a steel guard there then it would be a really fantastic knife so that about does it for this video because it's really not a lot of other close similarities in these two blades um, both fantastic different so there it is take it easy see you on the next video